Hey curl friends, I'm Bianca Renee and you're watching Bianca Renee today. And today I've got more curly hair products. If you watched my video last week, then you already know what we're about to talk about today. So bravo to you for coming back like you said you would. If that is you, leave me a comment down below just so I know who actually came back. I'm happy to say that Curlsmith is sponsoring yet another video because they just have so many products to share with you guys. And I've got two more for you this week, including the In Shower Style Fixer. What is that? Sounds confusing. Let me explain. As well as the Double Cream Deep Quencher. Another hair mask. You guys know I love a good deep conditioner. So the Double Cream Deep Quencher is a deep conditioner for dry or dull hair. Ultra moisture, supposed to enhance and revive. Of course, this product is sulfate, paraben, silicone free. It's also vegan, cruelty free, and certified organics. With Curlsmith, you're getting some good, legit ingredients for your hair. Some of the other cool ingredients in this mask include organic avocado, rose of Jericho, raw aloe vera, organic apricot, and rare Androba. And Androba? Androba. Rare Androba. I don't know what that is, but it sounds fancy. This also does not have any mineral oils, phthalates, or DEA, and you get eight ounces of pure goodness. So let's open up this bad boy, give you guys a little smell test. Ah, yes. If you guys are familiar with the other Curlsmith products that have the same orange color on here. It smells just like the rest of the line, so it's just a continuation of the line that they already had. Now when I applied my deep conditioner, I used it straight out of the shower and I split my hair into two sections. Now usually I detangle with my conditioner in the shower, but because I wanted to check the slip of this deep conditioner, I purposely did not detangle my hair in the shower so I could detangle right now for you guys on camera. And I'm pleasantly surprised, not really surprised because Curl Smith has been on a roll, but I was able to detangle with ease as you can see. After detangling I realized that I probably used too much because this was very easy to detangle with and very creamy so I actually just used the remainder on my right side and applied it to my left because a little does go a long way. So although you may know that Curlsmith is on the little bit of pricier side when it comes to hair products just know that a little does go a long way so you are getting your money's worth. After I was done detangling my hair I put it up and away in a clip and then I put on a shower cap and I let it sit for a good 30 minutes. It is recommended on the bottle to let it sit for at least 10 to 15 minutes before rinsing it out, but if you want that deep moisture, you leave it on for 30. Now I know what you're thinking, well you just told me to buy the other Curlsmith mask. Which one do I need? So let me break down the differences between these two. The Hydro Cream Soothing Mask that I reviewed last week, if you haven't seen it, I'll link that video below in the description box. But this mask is really focusing on the health of your scalp as well as giving your hair moisture because it has hyaluronic acid. But this is a little bit more of a lighter weight than the Double Cream. So this really works on all hair types, especially if your hair is thin or fine or even straight this is the one you probably should go for. But if you have high porosity hair, really thick curls, very, very intensely dry, or a tighter curl pattern, then Curl Smith recommends that you go with the Double Cream Deep Quencher. Fortunately, my hair likes both of them, so I'm probably gonna be going back and forth between the days where I need my scalp to get a little bit more attention versus just the very dry, maybe winter months where the lengths of my hair need moisture. I'll probably go back and forth because they both work great. Both of these masks are the same amount of product, 8 fluid ounces, but the Double Cream Deep Quencher is $28, where the Hydro Cream Soothing Mask is $29. So for a dollar more or less, choose accordingly. The other Curlsmith product that I'm really excited for is the In Shower Style Fixer. You might read that and be like, what do you mean, In Shower? Literally, it's their Stronghold Gel that you apply while in the shower. So if you want an ultra wash and go, you shampoo your hair, you condition it, and then you apply your styler in the shower while your hair is soaking wet. Now obviously, if you stepped out the shower, the bottle would not know, but they're really just trying to stress the point that this needs to be applied on soaking wet hair to get the best results. So this is their styling gel for curly and wavy hair, stronghold, high definition, anti-frizz and I'm happy to say that I've used this gel all week long. This is my day four hair 
and like look at this definition still shiny i'm getting that volume very very pleased with this gel if you guys know me you know i love a strong hold i don't even live in an area where i'm finding humidity you would think i did the way i love hold but i just really need a little bit of that slight crunch to get me through the week if i start off just really soft and fluffy It'll look good for day one, but I'm going to be frizzy by like day three. So my personal choice is stronger the better. And you can see right here it says extreme hold level 10. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. So aside from refreshing, I have used this straight out the shower two different times. One being literally in the shower after I shampooed, conditioned, I just applied it straight to my hair in the shower. And then the second time I applied it, just stepping out the shower, but still applying it on soaking wet hair. It was a little interesting for me to be applying it on soaking wet hair. I usually like to get a microfiber towel and dampen it just a little bit because my hair takes forever to dry. But I wanted to follow instructions, so that's exactly what I did. And I'm happy to say that I did see great results. And surprisingly, it did dry pretty fast. I think my hair dried within like an hour or so, which is a major accomplishment. Especially with these winter days coming, you don't want to go to school or work and then just be dripping wet for eight hours. Like, you will get sick. So the reason why they want you to apply this on soaking wet hair is so that you could lock in that moisture straight from the shower. Water is one of curls best friends, so we want to trap it in the curls. So you apply, it says a dime size, I'm not really a dime size type of girl, so I probably applied too much once again, but I like to split my hair into two sections, rub it together in my hands, smooth it down my hair using the praying hands method, and then you scrunch it back up to get that definition. The hand-picked ingredients in this gel is Rose of Jericho, raw aloe vera, organic apricot, black pepper oil, wild sunflower, and organic avocado. Isn't it nice to hear ingredients of like fruits and vegetables and like common words we know? <sighs> that should bring you peace of mind. So after my hair is about 85% dry and my hair has formed a little bit of that cast, this is when I know it's safe to start diffusing because I'm probably not gonna get that much frizz. So I'm flipping my hair from side to side, upside down and diffusing to get more volume. I've always noticed that I get better results from diffusing when I use a gel because I have that cast protecting my curls. And then the more I diffuse, it softens that cast, making my curls nice and soft and bouncy, yet defined with no frizz. Once my hair was completely dry and full of volume, voila, look at these results. And this is day one hair. I usually hate my hair on day one because it really is the flattest of the week, but I was able to get some great volume even on day one. The Stronghold Gel is eight fluid ounces. It's $27 available on the Curl Smith website and at Ulta in stores and online. So I'll make sure to put a link for this for you guys to check it out in the description box below. Now I know what you're thinking, Bianca, how many Curlsmith products do I need to buy? Well, let me break it down for you. If you are familiar with the Hold Me Softly Style Balm in their original line, this is a great product if you want soft hold. They also have the Curl Defining Styling Souffle. This is a nice souffle for a medium hold. But now with the In Shower Style Fixer, this one is going to give you that extreme hold. So buy according to what you like your hair to do. So comment below now because I'm curious, how do you prefer your curls? Do you like a soft hold, a medium hold, or a strong hold? I'm gonna tell you right now, if you live in a humid area, don't even, don't even look at these, okay? You need this strong hold gel or you will be frizzy by the end of the hour probably. Now if your hair is really dry and you know that an extreme hold gel is just gonna make it drier, I would suggest pairing it with the Curls Conditioning Oil and Cream. This is kinda like their leave-in that makes your hair really soft and moisturized. So use this first and then apply the gel on top and that should create a nice little combo for you. But obviously the more you deep condition, the less you have to worry about dryness. So what do we think? This is my day for curls. I am rocking the middle part. I'm trying to grow up my hair. You know, I'm going to see what these little scalp growing rice water concoctions do for me. <laughs> but I'm very happy 
with the look of my hair, the volume, able to get it to day four. I'm probably not going to wash it for another two, three days because I can. I have been able to refresh with this. Just make sure you're applying it to wet hair once again. Otherwise, it'll leave your hands pretty sticky if you just apply it to dry hair. So apply some more water, apply a little bit more, and it can refresh you all week long. Now, what I'm about to say is a very big deal because as some of you may know, I have probably mm, a thousand products in my curly hair collection here at home, but I am going to put the In Shower Style Fixer Stronghold Gel in my top five gels of all time. Congratulations. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I post new videos every week and you get to see me daily if you follow me on Instagram at Ms. Bianca Renee. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell so you're notified as soon as I post a new video. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today.